Breakfast is on, day one on the lake, coming up. We're gonna get Matthew a muskie today. He's fishing the falls. Yeah, let's go into where it opens up into a little bit bigger lake. Sorry, my phone. My phone's giving me contours, but my fish finder's not, even though it's the same app. Oh boy, everyone's heading out. Reggie had a bite. Come on, catch him. Just got on the lake for the first time. It's beautiful. Like, it's temperature out here, probably like 60s right now. It's gonna get 75, a little bit cloudy, no rain. You just got a rubber minnow on. Been on here about 10 minutes, so he's got a bite. All right, Matthew, pulling the big muskie. We're counting on you. I think Matthew's got a fish. Do we need a net? Oh, yeah, you got one. He's got a little northern. Leave yourself a little more line, and then you can just swing him in the boat. There you go, swing him in the boat. Matthew's first one with a fish. Told there you. he is. Good job. It's about 18. All right. Well, it's a start. First one in the boat. Right, right there. Right at the beginning. Out into that opening right there. Got a couple ospreys nesting up on the power lines there. Pretty cool. <laughs> okay, we got some birds over here. Annoying. Just, just being very annoying. I don't know if you can hear them or not, but it's pretty funny. Alright, we're coming just around this corner right here. This is where Reggie caught his biggest muskie when he was here last time. 42? I guess it was, no, it was 40 and a half. I thought it was 42, but right there so here's what it looks like so we thought we'd try it again he actually caught two in a row that time <clears throat> caught a smaller was 28 and then a 40 and a half one cast after the other bridge it goes into looks like Trude Lake right there. Trude Lake. There we go. Under the bridge. What kind of skills Reggie has here? Try not to hit the wall and try not to hit the sticks. Let's see. Let's back in the Oh look at that. Slides right by. What are you ducking for? <laughs> oh look at the bird. Oh, well, here he goes. Hey, baby. Right, nothing yet in Trude Lake. We're along this uh, edge here where it's, well, this is a little shallow sandbar. It goes right across there. But then up this edge here, it's six to eight feet deep. We'll find a few weeds or something and try in there. A couple other boats up there, so it might be good. It's a 
fish on. Fish on. What is it? I think it's a fish. I think it's a, it's definitely a, a bass. Well, I just thought, oh, there's the ledge right there. I'll just cast off that ledge. Yeah. Something to the, the I bass. I told you, man. Smally. It's a small little bass? I think so, yeah. Woo. He's a fighter, look at him. Woo! Here, if he lets go, I'll try to catch him. Come here, buddy. Yeah. Well, perfect hook right through the bottom lip. Don't let you shake here. Is it a keeper? Right through, <laughs> right through my bottom thumb is what it's going to be. Is it a keeper? Here we go. A little smallmouth. I'm going to say 12 inches. <laughs> exactly. Exactly. Yep. Ten? Twelve inches. Go. Hey dude. I'm gonna set you back. Hey, thank you though. Thank you for your thank you for your kindness. Woo. Got him right on that point, right on the drop off. We're still in that trude lake. Yeah, the top is a flowage there. See that big steep drop? I just threw it on top of there and drug it down that drop off, and that's where he was. You got one following it. See him? Yep. <laughs> I was like, is that a weed or something? Wait, you have one following? Yeah. All right, Trude Lake. What do we think? <laughs> Too bad he almost had a walleye. We had a bunch of little northern fall there, pre pretty tiny northerns. And I caught a smallmouth bass. There's some nice kind of shelves here along the edge, about six, six to eight feet deep with some nice weeds. And it uh, wasn't too bad. So we probably did better here so far than we did the other parts of the lake. All right, time to move on. Check out the, uh, the larger part, I guess. This is a dead end here, so we gotta go back and into the other part of the lake. Going under another bridge, going into the bigger part of the lake. This one's pretty low. Oh yeah, it's, <laughs> it's a head scraper. Bigger than yours. Could be the biggest of the day. Yep. Don't know yet. Could be the biggest one of the day. Maybe not. <laughs> so they're all about the same size. What aren't did they? I get? You had 15 and a half. Oh, there you go. I had 15 and a half. Yeah. He is 18 and a quarter. Boy, biggest one yet. You gonna eat that? No. No. Mm -hmm. so I get that award? No. Alright, we are actually at the Lake of the Falls. And here's the falls. Let's go take a look. Well, Matthew, what'd you catch today? Um, two northerns and almost a walleye. That would have been supper. Yeah. <clears throat> Reggie caught a northern and I caught a northern and a smallmouth. So that was the flamble flowage and it's actually true lake. We caught most of those on. Morning, we're having pancakes. It's gonna be day three in the water. We're gonna hit the lower flammable flowage. It's supposed to be 74 and sunny. Another actually nice day. We have, haven't been rained on yet, which is very unusual for us. Usually rains at least once, usually every day. But it is cooler right now. It's probably in the 
what do you say, upper 50s? 49. 49 degrees right now. And it is um, June 19th. So it's been unusually cold, so the fish haven't been biting as good as usual. They're slowing down a little bit. That cold front came through not too long ago and slowed everything up. All right, we're at Fisherman's Landing on the Turtle Flamble Flowage. This is a really nice landing. Nice big parking area and everything. It's, uh, we're camped at Lake of the Falls, so this gets us a little bit further down to the south end of the lake so we can fish the part we haven't fished yet. And we'll fish it uh, most of the morning, see how we do, and come in when we feel like it. Here's the actual landing pad, nice concrete pad with a nice wood dock. Looks a little shallow right here, but it drops off enough. Definitely a red stained water. Nice big turnaround area, lots of parking ramps. Or parking spots and if you go up there just to the left there's a parking spot up on a hill for overnight parking and some really nice bathrooms up there this little log cabin bathroom it's a real nice calm sunny day actually right now probably be better if it was a little cloudy air temps was 53 degrees when we just got here water temperature 65 degrees Yeah. Right now we're just working around this little island right here off the landing and then we're going to go down the shore and have a big, big open bay that's kind of, that's a little bit more shallow. We're trying these kind of bays back in here about seven, eight feet deep. Looks good. There ain't a whole lot for weed cover or nothing. I'm using the, trying some more musky baits. Got the phantom on right now. Just gorgeous back here, but... So far I haven't raised a fish. So one other guy fishing back here. <laughs> oh he's got one! Sweet! Alright, first one of the day. <laughs> Keep your fish under control, will you? <laughs> What's that out in front of you? Something just jump out in front? Ooh, what is it? Oh, there's one. Yep. Oh, I see him. He just came after mine. Here he comes. Matthew, throw it in front. Throw right up there. Right up. Right up. Right. Yeah, right there. Yeah. He's right there. Keep him. Keep it moving, though. Keep it moving. But a little faster. He needs to see it wiggle and go. Did you catch him on that little spinner? There he is. Oh. You got this little spinner bait you want to throw on? No, I have not. So that's where we're at, right in this little bay. Yeah, the big scheme of things right there in the lake. Right up there. Oh, fish! Woohoo! Fish on! Is it a fish? Yeah. Look at him. It's a northern. He is. Do we want to eat him? Yeah. Come here. Oh, Ooh, he's off. Hey, I'm getting my feet slimy. Hey, hey. I'm going to say 20, 20. 22. Ooh, Reggie might be uh, 22 and a half. Well, you are eating size. Ooh. But is going to eat him? Does everyone want fish again for dinner? Yeah. All right. In you go. Well, it's still been slow going. Just caught another northern. So Reggie's got two. I got one. Matthew's still waiting to catch one. Kind of back in. Uh, Shallower, it's kind of let's see. There's where we're at, right there. Kind of taking this, uh, there's this kind of goes into this lake area. Let's see, I'll show you a wider picture of it. 
kind of tooling through this lake, trying to hit all this. A lot of, a lot of little bays and islands, and there's a bunch of stumps up ahead. There's lots of good structure for fish to hide in. See there, all the stumps in the water. Got a bunch of weeds and stuff over here too. So, we might find some smaller northerns hiding in here. But it's the only thing that seems to be biting at the moment. Right here, you're gonna throw it right in there and catch one. No, that's not where. You throw it right, right there. Oh, right, you got him, I guess. Told you there's one back here. You're supposed to save that one for Matthew. <laughs> Is it a bass? Oh, it's an eater. It's an eater. Isn't that? No, I missed it. I turned around. <laughs> We're gonna save you just because we need to eat. It's all twisted there. Fish. You do? Matthew's got one. He does! It's a real fish. There, bring him over. Oh! Come here! Yes, Matthew's on the board! Woo! Did I tell you you're gonna catch one over here? What? Yeah. I told you that. Here's a Matthew catches. Careful, you don't want to break off your line on that thing. It's a big one. Okay, remember about leaving enough line? Dude. There we go. Big monster. Let's measure how long it is. <laughs> 30, 38. 38. Got a 38-inch stick. Good job. Dang, that was a pretty big monster. I would have caught. I would have kept that. But, uh... You got one? Yeah. What the heck is it? Looks like a baby. Well, you got one. Just like I said, you got a. Oh my gosh, is that is that smaller than Reggie's? <laughs> Okay, we need a picture of that it one. Counts. That one. It does count, but yeah. How come when I caught one like that, I can only keep it as a half? Uh, oh, <laughs> I don't know if your scale goes that low. Oh, come here, dude. Come on. It does. I just don't think it'll fit anymore. <laughs> <laughs> Put it across his whole body. You officially caught an 11-inch northern. There you are. Nice. <laughs> You're so officially weighed at four ounces. Four ounces. <laughs> Good job there, buddy. All right, I'll let Matthew shoot in there. Oh, jeez! Holy crap! The one yeah, it's a big northern. Just came up and whacked it. Wait, it was a big northern? Yeah. So on the map, we are right in this little spot right there. And you see that this is the river that used to run through here until it flooded. And if you take a look around, it's really a lot of stumps and uh, fairly shallow. Not sure if there's any fish back here. One of their boats went by, so gives me hope. But uh, we actually seem to have our best luck where the original lakes were. We did uh, so Blair Lake right there, and then we did uh, Trude Lake. We did pretty good on the uh, first day, and it's probably the two best spots we did. So I, don't know, I think we may end up going back in there, checking that out, or come back around and try this big spot out right here. So far, not, not a whole lot of action in this area, but Blair Lake, we did a couple. There he is again! Ah, Come on! Can you see it? Yeah, I saw him. Alright! Matthew's hooked up! Woo, look at that! Okay, don't reel it up any further. Let out a little line. Oh. Does that count in half? We'll count it, yeah. yeah. You got one? You do got one, don't you? No! <laughs> Come out of there. 
Now don't reel them all the way up. Just right about there and I'll swing them in. Oh, I got one. <laughs> right here at the boat. <laughs> hey, I got one. Oh, jeez. <laughs> oh, we got two of them flopping around here. Yeah, they're the same size. Oh, I tore his lip up. Oh, sorry, buddy. Aww, here, let's see if they're the same size. Are they twins? Hey, they're twins. Wait, is your bigger? Is uh, mine's mine's a half inch bigger. Okay. I'm Okay. Hey, hey, hey. Oh, go on in. Oh, he does have one. <laughs> I got one. Oh, yeah, two of them on. Out of the water. Hey, that's a pretty big one. Nice, that ain't too bad. Cool. Oh, what was that? They just have a bite? Oh. <laughs> Oh, you got a perch! Oh, it's a perch. Holy cow, that's a huge perch! There, that's a feisty perch. Look at this dude! Is that a big perch? Yeah, huge. that's huge! Hey, Look is it bigger buddy. than the one in the bass shop? <laughs> that's a nice perch! Yeah. So is that seven? Yeah. Seven to eight? I don't know, you got a lot now. Maybe out of the water? <clears throat> All right, we just spent a good 11 hours on the turtle flamble flowage, and it was sunny, it was about 74 degrees, and we all got a little bit of sunburn, but we ended up with about, uh, Matthew caught about eight northern, Reggie caught about eight, I caught three, I believe. We lost a few more than that, too. We didn't get on camera at all, but they're all pretty small, right around the 20 inch range. So we kept two for dinner. Uh, we didn't catch any muskies. Caught one perch actually, and no bass, no walleye. We weren't trying for walleye or anything. But uh, lovely lake. You just gotta watch out for all the stumps and rocks. We hit a actually kind of beach down a rock pile that came out of nowhere. There's no uh, signs for it. Nothing on our maps. Nothing. So luckily we weren't going too fast there. And now head back to camp and uh, start cleaning up the couple fish we got and have dinner. All right, tonight's brats, hamburgers, and beans. We're gonna save the fish for, for tomorrow night. Mm -mm, we're hungry, we spent, we've been gone for a good 12 hours and had nothing but a few snacks to eat, so we're hungry. Starving. <laughs>